What is going on guys? It's Ben here. So in today's video, we are on the level 12 account and we have a lot of gems as you can see. So we're going to do some chest openings. We're going to try to get some of the new rascals and also just legendaries in general. Um, it's going to help this account be more productive in wars as well. So why not? I mean, we have the gems and then also you may notice we have the clan in the, in the, what is it? Silver League 3. You can see on the profile, I really, really like how your trophy, or not your, not your trophy, your clan emblem reflects what place you are or what league you are in for clan wars. And I really like the gray, well, not gray, but the silver shield there. And then you can see the banner under that. Obviously, gold does look better, but we actually dominated our last war here. So you can see, uh, we didn't dominate actually, only, only won by five, but still, took first. That's two wars in a row now that we've actually taken first. Let's go over here and I'll... Okay, well, let's do all the stuff. Showing you the Silver League, the trophies we got. Collection. <laughs> so many things happening at once. Okay, so now we're back, and then we go here. You can see we have our silver ranked chest one. We have the or, league first place chest. Sorry, I'm, I'm like I'm like not on right now. All my like sayings are like a little bit not how I want to say it. <laughs> okay, but yeah, we have the gold chest. Um, we're first place chest for Silver League, and then we are kind of close to Gold League. I mean, we're 300, no, a little less than 300 away. We go over to here, we go to our passwords. Yeah, you can see we won two the last two times. So that's really, really nice. And this time we had 65 crowns with 34 wins. That's pretty good. Uh, that's almost every win getting two crowns. That's that's really, really solid. But if you want to join one-timers, currently we are full, as you can see. But I know players are leaving a lot and or we're kicking out like people that aren't, aren't doing their war attacks or whatever. So if you want to try and join it, we're trying to make this a very competitive war clan. So if you think uh, you got what it takes, we will keep the trophy count as as, as what it is. Um, but if you guys want to try and join in those open spots, why not? So other than that, today, like I said, we're doing chest opening. We're going to do some collection day attacks. And I'm just excited that we're in Silver League 3. Finally got there. It took us two wins in a row. We still have a, I know some clans um, are getting in the gold league now. Hopefully we get that very, very soon. Maybe we, if we have a chance to get it at the end of the season if we win um, two of the next wars. And I think if we take third, or not third, combination of winning two, or winning once and two seconds might get us there, or two first and one second. I don't know. I don't know exactly. Um, yeah, we're kind of close. Uh, so other than that, let's start with a chest opening here. Hopefully you guys, the wars are going good for you guys. Uh, a week we will get the chest. Hopefully this Thursday we have a cool challenge. That'd be pretty awesome. Uh, we'll take the guards here. I have, to, I have to remember on this account, it actually matters what I take. I'm so used to on the main, the main account using max levels. And I will say, guys, I'm gonna show you guys a crazy sudden. Well, I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's like the best, but it's a really good deck for war days with the rascals. If you guys are interested in that, I know not everyone has a max. We're not. I wouldn't say maxed out, but super high level because maybe you didn't buy the offers. Maybe you just didn't open up a lot of chests. Maybe you're just free to play. So I know it'll only be for that, but it's a really strong deck. Dominated with it earlier today. So I'm a main account, and I'll show you guys that probably in tomorrow's video. We got the Royal Ghost here. I'm gonna take him because it seems as though we always get him the wars, and I want to use him. Well, I already have him level two, so I guess there's a chance to get level three legendaries in the war. But more often than not, it's like if you have level two legendaries, you should be okay. Once you move up to gold, gold league, I assume it gets a little bit more cards, obviously, because as you go up in the different the different leagues, you get more and more cards for your wins. And also, if you didn't know, I know a lot of you already know this though. Um, if your trophy count in what league you are. All right, guys. So I actually ran out of the disk space on my computer. Obviously, I got rid of all the files now because I had so many like of my recorded videos just like sitting on my desktop. Those are all taken care of now. We got some more space. Uh, we missed out on a chest. I don't really know what I was talking about. Uh, but we'll take the Magic Archer here. I don't know if you guys saw my last choice. I took the Royal Ghost. Because for wars, you want to get your legendaries to like level 2 or level 3. And then as you... Excuse me. As you move up in the wars, you, uh, you, you have a better chance to get higher level legendaries for your war day deck. So you want higher level cards, obviously. And then as you move up the leagues in war, uh, the higher... Like, I don't know. It's... I feel like more people in higher leagues are going to have max out cards too. So you want your best chance um, to be on a fair playing field. So it would be cool if Wars didn't take your own account or personal level into account. But that is not the case right now. So see what we get here for this one. Um, 
I never really use the Ice Wizard. I really don't. So the log is probably going to come in clutch. I think the... I, pr I, I like the log because with Rascals being a thing... Oh, we got a ton of Rascals there too. Nice. We got 245 Rascals out of that giant chest. So crazy. So we, oh, more Rascals. So we're on a nice roll with some Rascals here. Let's get into a double Elixir battle though. Uh, if there was Draft, I would be playing Draft because I know I say this every video. When I'm on the level 12 playing collection days. If you don't want to be out leveled in wars, just play draft. <laughs> it's tournament standard. There we go. Um, But this is double elixir here. So, we'll see what happens. I'm probably playing... Oh, never mind. I don't know. Maybe graveyard, elite barbarians. I don't know. I thought I was going to be playing lava hound. Because usually that's the only thing that plays the tombstone at the moment. So he's going to throw down a fireball. Uh, I really shouldn't be pushing in all on this side. But you know what? It don't really matter. Let's just go in. See what happens. Show that we have the rocket. Uh, I don't know. What, is this? what does this dude have? So Hog Rider. And Mini P.E.K.K.A. I honestly did not see the Mini P.E.K.K.A. Not sure what happened to my bats. But that Mini P.E.K.K.A. got a ton of damage. So, the tornado wasn't really useful. I guess I'm going to have to rocket the mini P.E.K.K.A. We'll throw it on our P.E.K.K.A. I mean, it's double elixir. We don't have to wait. We really don't have to wait for anything. Uh, I'm just going to give him that tower. Yeah, there's no sense in me trying to defend that. So, I want to try and build up a huge push as possible. And this time, we are actually in a pretty decent spot right now. I kind of know what this guy has. Tornado everything together. Throw on some zaps. I haven't seen the mini P.E.K.K.A. just yet. Is there anything on the ground alive? Everything on the ground has died. Except for my Dark Prince that I literally just dropped. So we're having a tough time getting to this tower. With how, how much he can stop me here. Are getting some nice baby dragon damage though? I mean that counts for something, right? Okay, I gotta get a value rocket. That's really what needs to happen here. As long as that's tower, we're good. Okay. Now we can work on the other one. Was not expecting both of them getting dropped at the same time. The mini P.E.K.K.A. and... And that. Oh, God. And the Hog Rider. Alright, well, I originally was... That kind of fooled my plan. I originally was going to drop that stuff in the back. And then have my drop my Golem in the bridge. But, obviously, can't really do that. We're just going to hopefully he drops something here. Mini pack out a little bit too quick for me. It is getting some nice hits in there. Every time he fireballs this, so I'm not gonna drop over there anymore. All right, so. Hmm. He predicted me, but that was pretty good by his, his part. I'll give him that. I did not think he was going to be pushing that side. So he got some nice damage over there. I was predicting the rocket on the bridge. And you can see how that came back to bite me a little bit. And if he wants to play this tower or go for the three count, I'm cool doing that too. I'm fine with whatever way this dude wants to play. Or push. So now he still has to worry about my golem. Uh, sadly, it is only a night witch that he has to worry about over there. That's kind of lame. Let's 
So threw it on the mini P.E.K.K.A over there. Oh my gosh, dude. This is a struggle. Yeah. This is this is this is tough. So the man's John Weasley pulled it out in the end. <laughs> I couldn't I couldn't do it. Oh my gosh. I was trying to do the goal push, it wasn't working, but hey! We got the legendary for the war day in a Mega Knight. So I haven't really opened up many legendaries on when I'm recording here for when the war day battles and I feel like I'm gonna say this every time I feel like when you lose that that bra uh, that that it's wooden chest I was gonna say bronze chest that wooden chest always seems to have like so the legendary I don't know why and then obviously this is a tough choice oh that's not tough graveyard gets destroyed by poison but he has the tornado so he could activate his king tower uh good thing i do have the elixir collector because my battle like i think is gonna be a little bit heavy so the option if i don't have like something heavy was this the option a barbarian hut or a golem who in their right mind would take the barbarian hut over that that's not even fair or maybe it was royal giant golem okay that makes a little more sense here i was gonna say <laughs> This is rigged. All right, so I'll throw a dark goblin over here. It's got a balloon. It's pretty nasty. Thank goodness for this elixir collector. Otherwise, I would not be able to defend this like I am. Uh, I, I have to believe that he doesn't really have elixir at the moment. I know he has a tornado. So we have a pretty nice push. We're gonna go in with the graveyard. Um, that's not gonna matter. I thought he was gonna tornado my skeletons, and I think that seemed to be the better, the better call. But we'll start on Barbarian Hut. Probably get Golem dropped on us. <sighs> Catch a Caban. If he's not gonna drop anything, I'm just gonna pump up. That is a drop, and I still have enough elixir to pump up. It might get its hit. No, 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 no. Thank you. Dark Goblin coming in clutch. Alright, so things are going pretty well. I am still very scared of the Golem, though. Um. So if I throw on my Royal Giant way in the back, he's just going to use the Golem. We know that. So I'll be a little bit aggressive with it. I know... I know normally you don't drop it in the lane, but we gotta try. Gotta make him counter it. He doesn't have an Inferno Tower. Okay. We gave him the Zap. That's pretty good. But the Dark Goblin's just gonna shred it, man. And we still have a nice push going. And we're just gonna pump up. Just so we can counter him. Have our fast cycle. Nice. This is what can happen sometimes. <laughs> the pump! Don't got the answer? We're just gonna outcycle you here. Alright, so if this was final war day, I would say for sure you want to get as many crowns as you can, but for collection day, it doesn't really matter, so we're just gonna try and... I think he gave up. So, thanks. Good game. Good luck, sir. Uh, honestly, for collection day, even if you lose, still fine. You still get a uh, card to... Just do the battle! Just play the battle! Even if you don't think you're gonna win, just play the battle. Get, get those cards for your crown. Can we get two legendaries in a row, though? No, I, I, I feel like I never get a legendary in this chest. Obviously, I know it's possible, but I feel like it's so much more common out of the wooden chest. So we'll do some more of the legendaries king's chest. Uh, ooh, I'm going to take the magic archer, too. I just noticed that. Oh, and we'll take hog riders. And we'll take battle rams. We'll, we'll just buy out the shop here, dude. Why not? Except for, uh, except for you, bowler. Not for you. You're not worthy. <laughs> I really don't. I don't really use the bowler. I don't. I don't. Um, I mean, he's decent in the graveyard battle decks. I mean, in draft, I like him as a card, but in ladder, 
Not so much. What are your stances on the board? Do you like him? Do you not like him? I know we just faced him and got owned in double double elixir in, in our in our war. But uh I don't really use it's like the barbarian barrel. It's hilarious, you know? Let's do we get for a legendary though. Mm, what are my levels? I can't see my levels. I don't know. I don't know what I'm picking here. Uh, I think, I don't know, it seemed like this chest glitched out because you guys know how I clicked it kind of fast. Those legendaries popped up right away. So I'm kind of blind guessing. If I had to choose, I'm going to take the princess. All right, so we got her almost, I think if you get 10 of them, you get her to level three. So it was, it was okay. And then let's do our final war day battle. Let's see if anyone in the clan wants to play with me. Uh, we'll give them um, 10 seconds. There's six members on them. They must have all, probably a lot of them already did their, their attacks, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do you guys remember when like your parents would count down when you were younger? Maybe some of you younger that are watching. Never let your parents get to zero. Maybe let them get to three if you're kind of mad at them, but n n never let them get to zero because nothing good happens then. <laughs> All right, so now we'll just, I want to try sudden death. I really do. I'm sure if my clanmates have battles left, they probably would. I'm gonna play sudden death. I'm gonna do the bridge spam. Bridge spam sudden death. I'm not the best sudden death player. I know a majority of these sudden death battle decks are balloon freeze, hog freeze, some of them are graveyard. So we're going a little off meta here for the for the uh for the for the double or the sudden death, but I didn't want to play double elixir. I feel like I play that every video. Can we get a value fireball here? First time ever? Well that's a pretty good tornado. Yeah, bro, that's pretty good. So I shut down my attack. I don't have to worry. I do not have to worry about the bandit. Uh, Infernal Dragon for the wizard. Pretty nasty push coming up here. Gonna get... Um, I missed. Missed the, missed the tower. <laughs> I was gonna say, we're gonna get Tombstone. But we still have some nice, some nice damage troops there. Royal Ghost coming in. Oh, that's dirty. Wow. I'm not used to matches being done that quick. That shows you how much I play Sun Death. That was so quick. <laughs> all right. So, two and one in today's war day. I won all three on my main account. Yes. I clicked too fast. I didn't think I was going to legendary. Double clan chest collection legendary. That has never happened to me before. Both of them were Mega Knights. Uh, but we'll take it. And yeah, you can see since uh, I'm in, I forget the name of it. This is my master one. I got some more cards compared to, cause like, I'm telling you, as you, those league, or maybe, maybe I, did, maybe I had to cut this part out when I ran out of space on the computer. Just, how much do I have? Now we're good. Um, was, uh, if you're in a higher league for ladder, you get more cards in your war. So trying tro trophy push. Uh, that's why for for trophy or for wars, I'm going to keep it at 4,300. Because uh, you get more cards the higher league you are in. And then Benson will do only 800. But yeah, so not bad for collection day. A little mini chest opening from the Legendary's King's chest. We're getting close to being able to do some huge upgrades for the account. I mean, some notables are Goblin Gang. The log, if that comes about. I guess you could say Archer. Sometimes I have been having to use those. Dark Goblin. Uh, I don't really use that in Final War Day battles. Uh, Musketeer, maybe. Hog Rider, we're getting close. I need to get him to level 10. That would be really, really nice. But uh, other than that, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Stay tuned for more awesome videos. I'll keep you updated if there's any Clash Royale news in the world. Well, that doesn't make sense. I was going to say I was going to keep you updated on Clash Royale news in the world of Clash Royale. But that doesn't make sense. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'll see you guys later.